Hi everyone, I want to make a very quick video for a kind of a common gotcha uh, that uh, both uh, confused me initially and I've seen other people getting confused by it. So specifically, when you write a Triton kernel <clears throat> and you call it, you will have typically more parameters that you're passing in than will actually go into the actual kernel. And this can be confusing, so I wanted to kind of explain what's going on here. So uh, up here I've got the softmax, a few softmax. Um, so for the forward uh, here, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven params going in. But when we jump up to here, we see we have one, two, three, four, five, six. So we've magically gone uh, from seven to six uh, parameters here. So that's uh, quite confusing. So, but what's actually happening um, is some of these parameters are uh, Triton reserved keywords, um, also I believe referred to as meta parameters. So they refer more to the structure or parallelization aspects, uh, kind of a hyperparameter basically for the parallelization and don't actually uh, make it all the way to the actual kernel code itself because the compiler will absorb it. So what specifically are these uh, reserved keywords? Um, let me show you that. Um, right, so this in the code for Triton here, Runtime Interpreter, uh, if you see, there's actually four of these. So we've got num warps, num stages, num CTAs, and evil warp specialization. So these reserve keywords, when you actually call here under grid executor, yeah, under the call itself here. So once you're actually initializing a kernel call, um, you can see here that it's got this code removes reserve keywords from quarks. So quarks equals blah, blah, if not in reserve. Uh, keywords. So that's basically what's happening. So the compiler itself is going to absorb those um, parameters. And there's four of them. So a quick uh, overview of what those four are. Um, yep, so it's num warps, num stages, num CTAs, and enable warp specialization. And get the pointer. Yeah, and just a quick review of what these are. Um, num warps is the number of warps to use for the kernel itself. And so a warp is basically 32 threads by default. So if you say num warps equals eight, then it's really going to do eight times 32. So you'll actually be running cooperatively with 256 threads. So that's num warps. Num stages, this is for uh, software pipelining. So it's basically the number of stages the compiler should use for software pipelining loops. Uh, primarily use is for matrix multiplication. And basically pipelining just means the loop iterations are overlapped. And so sub subsequent loop iterations will start before the previous iteration is completed. And the goal there is to kind of achieve an overlapping effect and therefore maximize or improve your performance. Um, NumCTAs, I don't have a full understanding of this completely, but it, it's basically cooperative thread arrays. Um, and so it's an array of threads and they execute a kernel concurrently or in parallel. Seems to be in general that you can basically have different CTAs and they can communicate with each other and therefore you can do things uh, in a more uh, concurrent fashion. But um, yeah, I'm not really too detailed knowledge on that, but that's what it's referring to. Um, and then lastly, warp specialization. Uh, this is just a, a Boolean. So this would be uh, also known as spatial partitioning. So it's basically allowing warps to perform independent computations. Um, so the typical use pattern here is for producer consumer setup. So one warp would be producing data and the other one would be um, produce, uh, excuse me, consuming uh, data. So that's warp specialization. So those are the four keywords. Um, so like I said, I just wanted to highlight these, kind of clarify what they are in general, and just so you won't be alarmed when you see a function call that doesn't make sense because it may have eight parameters going in and suddenly only are, are going to it and six or so arriving, and that's because the compiler has absorbed it, and these are the meta parameters or reserved keywords for the Triton compiler. So hope that helps.